Taurus. So they hold back, huh? Taurus. Because um, the energy I got was, I've been holding back all I feel. Love so real. But I can't wait another minute. So, whoever this person is, they hold back their emotions from you. Call it trust issues, whatever it may be. They don't um tell you how they feel about you. Let's go ahead and get into your message, Taurus. Beloved, what's going on with Taurus, please? Creative power. And it's coming up as like an empress type energy, right? Something's ready to be birthed into the atmosphere, Taurus. Something, something that's taking some type of energy is ready to be birthed. Now, I don't know if it's within that, that uh, I've been holding back what I feel energy. I'm not sure if that was for you, Aries, or if that was for you. But let's go ahead and get into this message and see what's up. I'm filling these cards for you, Taurus. Let's see what's up. Beloved, what's going on with Taurus? What's the message you have for Taurus, please? What's the message you have for Taurus? What's the message for Taurus? this ten of pentacles though Taurus I get big money energy I'm talking about a bag I'm talking about hundreds thousands big money energy and I don't know why I'm getting that when um love energy coming out but big money energy let's see what's up you got the um you got the uh the magician the King of Swords, the Seven of Pentacles, the Five of Swords, the Two of Pentacles, the Sun, the Four of Swords, the Ace of Pentacles, the King of Pentacles, the Eight of Cups, the Ten of Swords. The Four of Cups. The Two of Swords. The Three of Pentacles. The Knight of Wands. And the Two of Wands. I don't never like your energy, Taurus. I'm going to tell you why. Because you always got some hating ass people around you, Taurus. And every time it comes out in the reading... I feel like don't nobody want to hear. I feel like they want to hear the um the love messages. But can we talk about the real stuff that's going on around you, Taurus? Now, you got people around you. <laughs> it comes out every time I get into your reading. You got people around you that you fight and argue with them. You think it's just on general purpose, on GP. But no matter how many times I get into your energy, you see those people back there that's that's like finna pounce on him? You want to know why it is, though, Taurus. Because you're a person that make something out of nothing, right? And these people wonder how you do it, you know? You just over here and this magician energy, right? Like... I'm finna bring something into this damn atmosphere, right? Finna bring something into this world. I know what I want. I know exactly how I'm gonna get it. And beloved, it's like, 
I got you, Taurus. What you want? And you got it, right? You got it. You put it to work. You took care of it. Everything. Now, you getting a, a little something that's moving for you in your life. You getting some type of traction or something. But you got some hating ass people around you. I'm so tired of reading these people. It's like some tourists just ain't getting it yet. Because beloved is still talking about it. Because you took one pinnacle, turned it into two with no problem. Happiness, joy, and peace is supposed to be yours, right? Because B Beloved gave it to you. Everything that Beloved gives you comes down, you know, and beauty and all this type of stuff, right? Because you birthed something. You brought something into the earth. Problem is, with you tourists, you always got to keep open doors and open windows with people. And a lot of your blessings are being blocked. Want to know why? Because you are distracted with those type of things. Even though you're in your power. You're the king of pentacles. Here's beloved trying to give you this next blessing. But this, this blessing is blocked because of the people you got around you. See, maybe these people have you turn up with them or something. Right? Kick it with them. You know, let's get Taurus drunk. Let's make sure Taurus high or fucked up or whatever it may be. Oh, I'm so tired of reading this energy, Taurus. This energy been coming out for months. There's a Taurus that really need to get this message so we can move on. But these people are just waiting for the chance to pounce on you. I don't know how many different ways it could be depicted. You always got somebody around you that's watching your every move, trying to watch the way you move and the way you get things, right? But as long as they're around, ain't nothing coming into fruition because the blessing is yours. The blessing's not for them. You see, you this magician that keep popping up and this red cloak, right? This is how you show up around your people. Beloved, don't let them see your uh, coat of many colors. Oh, okay. Beloved, we going there. Now, because Beloved want me to tell the story of Joseph and his brothers. So, I'm going to try to shorten it. So, Joseph's mama, right, was barren for years before she had Joseph and Benjamin, right? And uh, her husband was married to her and another woman. And the woman used to taunt her. Like, yeah, he loved you, but I got all the kids. And da, da, da. and she'll be in the, in the corner like, you know, God, can you please just open my womb? I promise if you just open my womb, right? So God finally opens her womb. So fast forward to the kids. You know, the kids are older and whatnot, you know. It's the 12. Um, he obviously had two kids with Hannah, I think her name is. And then he had two kids with, I mean, 10 kids with, I forget, get her name, right? But um, the, the 10 brothers couldn't stand Joseph because they know that Joseph wasn't one of them. Like, yeah, he was his father's son, but... They knew that uh, that uh, his father had favor on him, right? So, um, you know, daddy, he mess around and give um, Joseph this coat of many colors. The, the rest of them didn't get this coat. Just Joseph got this coat. So they like, shh, huh, huh. Yeah, all right, yeah, dad don't gave him this coat, yeah, I don't like him, no way, yeah. So, one day they going out, they going to hunt or sell something, whatever they was going to do. They wanted to take Joseph with them, but their dad was like, no, nah, I don't take Joseph, he too young, and so on and so forth. They're like, dad, we'll take care of him, you know, whatever. So, um, they, they take um Joseph with them, you know, they sell him to some bandits and whatnot. He ended up in all kind of prisons, all kind of situation. 
he, until he became like the emperor of, um, I want to say, I sound like Medea, but he became the emperor of what, what, what country was it? Um, I forget the country, you guys. But his brothers come years later, and he the man, he got the bag, right? And they got to bag him because God sent a famine in their town, right? That's the reason why Joseph was sold, so Joseph could go ahead of everybody because God knew it would be a famine. You know, that's God and all his wisdom and glory and might and all that type of stuff, right? So I say all that to say this. This is really you, Taurus. In the spiritual realm. But God allows for you to show up like this. Right? Because if you showed up like this. Then people. Will do way worse than what they're planning on doing to you. Okay? You're you're meant to be. What do it say? Release your alchemy energy into the world. And the first thing that comes out is the magician. That's because you're a natural alchemist. Taurus. And this is what these people are trying to figure out. Like, how do tourists do it, right? Now, there's someone coming in. Someone that's an ally, right? That's coming in to expose these people to you. Whoever this person is, this is a person that God is sending for you, right? They're not meant to be in your life long. They're meant to show you something and move around. Let's see. Who is this person that's coming towards tourists? Because this is also a person that got a call on their life. Okay? This is also a chosen one. Okay? Who is this Knight of Wands? Who is this Knight of Wands? And you know what? Now that I'm thinking about that song. Because I've been holding back all I feel. Love so real. You know. This is what people will have you believe, Taurus. That they down for you, that they love you, and <laughs> everything and what it seems. Who's this person? Three of Cups, Two of Pentacles. This is a person coming in to give you a message for you to get on your square. This is definitely an ally. This is definitely someone that's sent from Beloved. To show you what's real. And who's real around you. Who's fake. Now you're going to be skeptical about this person. Whether or not you should take their advice. But they're coming in with a message from Beloved. Okay. They're coming in. Really to expose some things to you. That you need to see Taurus. Because whoever energy this is. I keep reading every time. Y'all don't want to hear this. But Beloved feels like this is the most important message. For you to hear at this time Taurus. Like. Why else does this energy keep coming up? Okay. I don't. I don't have. I wonder if these work. I'm going to use my Divine Masculine Real Talk Oracles. I want to see if I can see who these friends are. Or these people that surround you. That you need to watch out for, Taurus. Where are these people that surround Taurus? That Taurus needs to watch out for, please. these people around Taurus. The Taurus need to watch out for, please. That's crazy. Wow. What? Give me one person. I love it. Huh. Beloved ain't saying nothing. This 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 one here, this Knight of Wands energy could be a younger energy. You going for some reason you not gonna want to hear what this person gotta say. Maybe because they're young and you don't feel like young people know much. But take heed, whoever this young fire sign is that's coming in, or have fiery type energy, they gonna come off. Like they talk fast or something like that, but they're coming off with truth. They send from heaven for you, okay? Because I 
<laughs> Look at this combination here, Taurus. Night Watcher, Stalking, Money Making Mitch, and Illegal Hustle. I don't know what you do. I don't know how you get your money. But this is how they see you. That's how they see you. It's money making Mitch. Okay? That's you. That's how they viewing you. Okay? This illegal hustle energy. I don't know what's up with it because there's another card out here. Heart hurting. Like, maybe they're able to take... See... Sometime when you're going through a heartbreak or pain, this is what beloved do want to say about your love life. Sometime when you going through heartbreak and pain, you distract it. You're not able to see uh, things that's more relevant in your, in your life, right? But it's definitely something going on here, right? On the internet or something, maybe it's not a legal hustle. Maybe it's just the way you get money, but somebody is watching Okay. No, that's not it for night watching. Those are a lot of people that watch you at night, Taurus. And see what's up with you. See what you're doing. This is the stalking energy right here. Yeah. So you, it keeps coming out. This energy keeps coming out. I keep trying to avoid it. I be deleting readings. Because I'm like, Taurus them don't want to hear that. But Beloved is like, it ain't about what Taurus want to hear. It's about what Taurus need to hear. Okay? So I'm going to pull you a message. And go ahead and get out your energy. Because I already know this one. Ain't going to get that many views. Because it ain't love related. But somebody, somebody somewhere need to know. Huh, you got a lot of snakes in your grass and they slithery and slimy. Okay, beloved, what's going on with Taurus? And it fell on money making Mitch. It's interesting, these monkeys came out because it's a monkey here that's holding the pinnacles. I'm just saying, so it got something to do with the finances. Okay. If you subdue yourself and return to the practice of what is right, if one day you achieve self-control and return to what is right, the world will acknowledge you as a person at his best. Being the best must come from you, yourself. One cannot acquire it from others. Oh, wow. Look at nothing, which is contrary to what is right. Listen to nothing contrary to what is right. Speak nothing contrary to what is right. And do nothing contrary to what is right. You will then be a person at his best. And I'm going to leave it there, Taurus. I don't want to interpret it for you because, yeah. You guys, whoever this message is for, you know exactly what that card means. Do nothing contrary to what is right. Either way, Taurus, that's the message I have. I thank you guys so much for tapping into Black Madonna HP's Table Etiquettes. Please make sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, love, peace, and so take care.